So the Core 98 got a nerf, but it's not like a stereotypical Call of Duty nerf. What they decided to do here is lower the aim assist down from marksman level category and put it on the same scale as sniper rifles. So definitely not gonna be as easy to use at this point, but still the best quick scoping, fast paced option in the game. It's still a very reliable one shot kill. And at the end of the day, there's nothing else in the game that's really like this thing. I still see it as a very popular weapon. I still get killed by it quite a bit. And I think the nerf did enough because you don't, you know, kind of get aim locked on by aim assist, but it's still a very rewarding kill. For my first attachment here, I'm using the range caller V3.4 optic. That's just the classic car 98 iron sight or optic. You can use whatever you want. You can go with the iron sights or a different optic. It is going to come down to preference here. For the stock, I am going with no stock because that's going to give you the largest increase to ADS along with sprint to fire movement and aim walking speed. It is going to have quite a bit of a kick to it along with a little bit more flinch resistance, but for fast paced play that I'm going to be doing, this is 100% necessary. Looking at all these statistics here, 20% of the sprint to fire is massive. We also get 10% of the ADS. And then you can see the rest of the overall movement here. This is an extremely important attachment for quick scope or fast paced play. For my under barrel, I'm going with the DR6 hand stop to again, increase the handling and mobility, not nearly as extreme as the no stock, but we are still getting 6% of the ADS, 12% of the sprint to fire, along with some other small values there towards movement. For our barrel, I have the Bryson Carbine S. That's gonna give you aim walking speed, hip fire attack stance, spread name down sight speed. I'm really only using this one for the ADS. The rest of the stuff is an added bonus, but we are getting an additional 5% there to the aim down sight speed. And my final attachment is the SL Razor Hawk Laser Sight to increase aim walking steadiness, tack stance, Obviously, we don't get tag stance on a sniper, but we do get sprint to fire and ADS, and that's the main two I am targeting there. Another massive 20% to the sprint to fire speed and 7% there to the aim down sight speed to give us an extremely fast aim down sight speed and very good for quick scoping. So as always, here's all of your attachments on the screen. I'm trying out this camo that I got from the get high event or get higher event or whatever. It's cool. I don't know how much I like. It's a little distracting in game. It's a, it's a cool concept, but I don't know how big of a fan I am of it. You guys go down in the comment section. Let me know if you guys have unlocked this thing yet. Here is also the rest of the loadout on the screen. If you guys need to pause to also copy this one down, we're going to jump into a gameplay, feature some quick scopes, feature, feature some hard scopes, feature some close range, feature some long range. You guys can get a grasp of what the nerfed car 98 is looking like here in Modern Warfare 3. Make sure you hit the like and subscribe button for me if you haven't already. Let's get into it. So something that I found a little funny is I've been recording with the car 98 for here for a little bit. And I just ran into somebody who was convinced I was cheating, but I didn't even have a 2KD. I had like 54 kills. I was like 54 and 26 or something, 54 and 28. Uh, it, it wasn't even like a good game. There's a reason you guys aren't gonna see it. Like I shut off my recording because I was getting crapped on, but even though I get crapped on sometimes, even though I sometimes get, you know, Get the Schmeet dropped on me. I still like to finish the games because you know the XP, the event challenges, whatever. He was convinced I was cheating. I was trying to explain like, if I was cheating, why am I dying 28 times? I must be the worst cheater in Call of Duty history. Like there's no way I should be dying 20 something times if I, I am in fact cheating. You know what I mean? And on top of that, I'm using a one shot weapon. So there really isn't a way that I should be dying that much. I just get a, there was two of them there, wasn't there? Did I just get a clap? I guess I didn't, but it, I don't know. But like, yeah, he was like, oh, you're, you're dead, you're cheating, reported for cheating. You're reporting for cheating. Like I was his go-to, you know what I mean? Reported for cheating. And I always laugh at those comments. Because if I was cheating, how the heck would my account be level 842? I just, it's more of a comedic effect. I wish I would have kept recording from the beginning of the game, but normally when I'm off to like a rocky start, I never uh, keep the recording on. You know what I mean? I just got to make sure I mute the other team. Or we got people out here passionate. All right, drop it right on the hill. That really didn't get us a kill. Got the advanced. I'm not even targeting a nuke here, to be honest. It's not that big of a deal. One mistake with a weapon like this and you ain't getting a nuke. So it's not really the end of the world to me. 
What? Okay, that was a strange hit marker. If I get the DNA bomb, I get it, but like, it's not something that's guaranteed here, nor do I really care that much. It would be nice to get it, but at the end of the day, sometimes you can't. Winning the game will be more important to me in this situation. However, I am feeling good and I'm hitting my shots pretty well. They're gonna walk into my shots, we like that. Ah, oh, they just spawned behind me. I'm gonna hit the UAV, that was almost real bad. I missed the shot, that's what I was talking about, by the way. All right. I don't know what streak I'm on, but because I'm close, I'm gonna try to go for it. If I die, I'm not gonna freak out or anything. It will be disappointing, of course, but. That is a 20, so there's some potential here. This is always the hill that messes me up though. Because there's so many places they can come from. I'm gonna run. All right, what are we gonna do here? Let's see, I'm gonna VTOL it. More for the UAV perspective of it. We'll drop it right there. More for that info. Now, if I were this guy, maybe this corner. Oh, that helps. He's right there. And that's a DNA bomb. That smoke, that smoke right there is putting me for a twist. It's hard to see through that. Wow. Huh, I kind of want to use WSB Swarm now. Behind us. No, I, I thought I had one shot in that and I didn't. All right, so I'm gonna hold this. I think we can break this hill, so I'm not gonna hit my DNA bomb. I'm gonna hold that to see if we can use that to see the hill's already broken, but see if we can break the objective here. You costed me, pal. I was jumping on the hill, teammates are straight up costing me. Homie missed his shots. There we go. Good thing I got that DNA bomb because I'm definitely not shooting straight at the moment here. Let's hit DNA. There we go. I. Are they going to be over here? Oh, he stalked me. He didn't. No, he didn't. I just watched them spawn in, by the way. I don't know if you guys could see that. I was watching them spawn in. So, up 46. There's a VTOL. Not that the VTOL is going to get me any kills here, but it doesn't really do anything on this map. That's an advance that we can work with. Got it. Advanced UAV. Hard point compromised. Secure the area. I'm 
Thanks for saving me, teammate. Love ya. Oh, that was... Well, I don't think he was aiming at me. I think he was aiming at teammate. Yeah. What can you do? You jump shot and pal, that didn't work. Oh, good kill, bro. I didn't see him till last second. He had a signal 50. Is that thing good? This game. Sure, they spawned in me. Lock in on the OBJ time. It is hard. That's why I keep picking up. Oh. Wasn't ready for that. I keep having to use the pistol and or pick up weapons around the hill because of the challenge there. Alright, they should all be over here. I was very wrong. They were all over there. If things go well, we should have one objective left. That's if things do go well, though. Gotta make sure I keep the, uh... The one thing about the Car 98 is I wish I had a magazine, you know what I mean? Oh my goodness. Well, oh, what a grenade, my goodness. 79, I was trying to crank the kill count up there. I was actually hitting towards the end of that one. 